<laughs> uh, 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 okay, you introduce. I always introduce. Why do I always have to introduce? Welcome back, guys, to Pillow Talk. Thanks! We have pillows and we talk and play video games. It's very fun. We're going to ask about some stuff. <laughs> Scouching softball! Look, I'm just fucking nailing it with like the, the questions today. So, is softball coach the life you wanted, or was it the life that was thrust upon you? You know, some men aren't born great, but born into greatness. <laughs> I'll admit that I was hesitant at first. Briar Hazel had so much energy, we just had to get him into sports. But no one was there to run the team. The more I, the more I did, the, most I, the more I saw how much it meant to all those girls. I'm, you ever just respect women? Like, the, I'm worried to be a riot if I quit. I would also be afraid of a bunch of tiny children with metal bats. They're quick and they work as a team. I've trained them too well. They'd take you down like a pack of velociraptors on a T-Rex. Shit. That happened in Jurassic World. Spoiler alert. Hey. Exactly. <laughs> ask about the business. What business? What business? I don't know. Should we just ask them? Yeah. So, you... Dude, I'm fucking yelling with the fucking hearts. So, you run a business now? Yeah, we sell fitness gear, imports, and exports mostly, but we're coming up with our own line of athleisure wear soon. Is this... This really is Caleb. I nod. I mostly use my sweatpants for watching TV and not, you know, sweating. Sounds like he'd make a killing. If you ever need athletic gear, I've got your back. <laughs> you could sponsor me. I'll rep your athleisure wear brand while I mow my lawn. Then you can look at my ass. Kill shot. That's the glamorous lifestyle we're catching to, yeah. I can't believe you're a father of three. Neither can I. You know me, I'm an indecisive person. I don't think they're all mine. <laughs> I'm very confused most of the time. You switched your major four times. Uh, I've switched mine nine. <laughs> Wait, really? That many? Yeah, nine. I thought it was like five. No, it was nine. Oh, I counted them all. Yeah, I had no idea what I wanted to do with my life, but raising kids, when Briar and Hazel were born, it all finally made sense. I was like, all the time I had spent trying to figure things out led to them. Well, like, think about, you know, I, people always look upon, like, down upon, like, switching majors or so much, but, like, think of all the knowledge you're acquiring. Jack of all trades, master of none, my brother. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I couldn't be happier about it, you know. I don't think I've ever cared about anything as much as I care about them. <laughs> this is like Caleb don't, talking to me about his, the girl he likes. I forgot to restart this. Keep going. Ah! Oh, that's me. I had the exact same feeling when Amanda was born. It was the best thing to ever happen to me. It could be the only thing that ever happened to me. And I would still be proud of the life I lived. It's nice out there. Out here. Quiet. You want to make it loud? Must be good to get away from the softball moms for a bit, huh? Huh? Christ, Janet. <laughs> yeah, that was a lot. Are you always? Are they always like that? Actually, this wasn't nearly as bad. Yikes! I'm just not in. So not interested. <laughs> well, what are you interested in? Dick. I'm questioning the sexuality. Peace and quiet. That was a great way to avoid that question. That, that hot, hot silence. Hot. My ultimate sexual fantasy is sleeping in on a Saturday. I, yeah, same. The baby's just like, this is not what I want to hear. From <laughs> but more seriously, I just can't get back into, fuck. I feel so oh, uncomfortable trying happened. to introduce a stranger into my girl's lives. They've already been through so much. I can't put them through that. Oh, God. Buddy, I hear you. So, the moms can help me all they want, but the girls are my top priority. The right person will come along eventually. Yeah. Oh! Dude, yeah. I fucking got the eggplants! I got a little boner. You don't have to rush it, man. <laughs> yeah, no, every decision I've ever made in my life is going to lead to this one moment of somebody coming into my life. And it's the right time, it's the right person. I don't know when it's going to happen, but it's going to, you know, blah. It's that, nothing. Has he said that? No, I just made that up. Oh, that was really good. 
Things will fall into place for you, and someday you're going to find someone who... Whoa, whoa, whoa. You don't have to rush it, man. Things will fall into place for you, and someday you're going to find someone who cares about your kids just as much as they care about you. I'm pretty sure I, I just paraphrased that. I'm sorry. Bro, that is so sweet. He's just like... Shit. What if he missed a softball and just smacked the kid and he's just like... <laughs> <laughs> And he makes that exact face he's he like, <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm distracted. I missed a softball, and it hits me right on the head. Fuck! Wow, that really hurts. And it was right all along. They're not soft. Yeah, sorry, dude. <laughs> Craig runs over to me. Are you okay? Oh, God. You okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Wait, let me do the dad thing for a second. Craig spends a moment examining my head. It's worse than I thought. Don't tell me you have to kiss it to make it better. You would be so lucky. <laughs> Kissing is for the weak. Aww. Aww. That was planned. Kissing's for... Oh, shit. Dude, what should I do? Fuck. Kissing's for the weak? You just want me to romance Tommy Wiseau? <laughs> <laughs> Chill. He has my heart. <laughs> I'm gonna say I mean dot dot dot. Look at that baby. He's just like... Fucking idiot. You're thirsty too. Didn't catch the... the <laughs> oh god, you're hitting on my dad too. Get the fuck away from me. I feel like, like I've earned it at this point. Waiting all day to hang out with you. Well, you know... Oh shit. It, oh! I got a fucking kiss, dude! Walk well, it off, champ. Oh, okay. He slaps my ass. Damn it. Are the lights on the softball field really hot, or is that just me? The baby's just like, yeah, you, you, you did it. Good job. You got a yeah, fucking metal. <laughs> you got a boner. I get up and dust myself off. River yawns. <laughs> hey, little buddy, you must be getting tired, huh? Hate to say it, but I should probably head out. Sorry, I think it's so. You get older and life just gets in the way, huh? Women. We start walking back to the parking lot. Hey, remember that one house party we went to that got broken up by a helicopter? How could I forget? You and me hopped over a concrete wall to get away. I've done that before. But the other side of the fence was a parking lot where a bunch of cops were parked. Oh man, yeah. Can you ima Could you imagine the look on our faces? We just walked straight past them like we were out for a stroll, and not knowing that they were at that we were at the party, they started joking with us about how how big of a bus it was. We had to talk with them for thirty minutes. You told them you were interested in joining the academy. Yeah, and then they started giving me pointers for exam. Longest thirty minutes of my life. Man, college. Yeah, I, I'm gonna. I'm thinking about going to the academy. <laughs> Good old days, right? We get back to our cars. Craig pulls me into a hug, or at least as much as we can manage with the baby between us. Never enough time, huh? Guess not. Let me make it up to you. Let's hang soon, yeah? Yeah? Yeah. I like that. Oh! Yeah, juice box. Ah! I yawn as I walk through the door, spying Amanda hunched over her collage, glue stick in hand. Burning the midnight art oil. Figured I might do something productive between episodes of Shark Hunter lip sync battles. Do the shark's Sorry. lip sync or do the, the, the shark hunter's lip sync? Yes. <laughs> I agree. I look, <laughs> I look over her shoulder at the collage. Uh, Amanda, this is so... <laughs> <laughs> this, is some, this is some good art look at this good art you made thanks I'm just about done they're all dogs like before, it's still a lot of dogs in one corner is a giant pile of cash and the other it's Amanda is that me yep the whole thing's about my goals in the future and those are basically just to sit on a giant pile of money with my 20 dogs and also have a strong mutually supportive relationship with my father into adulthood Aww. <laughs> Oh, Dad. Hey, how was your hang with Craig? I'm sorry. I'm so, uh, I'm so, the Craig guy sure is busy. Yeah, dude, the softball life isn't for quitters. Also, I'm very proud of you for facing your house feel. I'm on top of the world. Pops, I should start facing my fears more often. I'm afraid of money. <laughs> oh, yeah. How about tomorrow we hit some empty parking lots and practice, dare I say, parallel parking? 
Baby steps, Dad. I'll work my way up to it. All right, I'm going to hit the hay. Take care of late night television for me, all right? I'll let them know you said hey. And then you look out the window and see none other than... <laughs> I'm slaying these dad dates. Thirsty? <laughs> and the baby's just like, you damn right you are. Oh, oh, oh. We still got time in the episode. What should we do, Dylan? Um, what path should we commit to? Oh, let's save first. How about that? Yeah, do that. Do that. Okay. Um, I'm still co I'm still committed to Damien, but it wouldn't hurt to go on like go see someone else too if you wanted. Yeah, that <laughs> seems like the safest. Way. <laughs> Youth minister, I want I want him to have a cult or something like really badly. You have well, no idea. Well, let's find out. I want him to be a fucking cult. Oh, like. <sighs> Now it's time to take risks. His family is a little weird, but Joseph seems cool. I should take him up on his offer to hang out. Where did my mouse go? Plus, I haven't done my box. It's right there next to... Yeah, there it is. Let me yeah, fucking... Bang, bang. Boom, bitch. Let me hit you up. Wait, how do I hang out with a priest? I don't go to a church. Should I be Jesus-y? <laughs> I imagine Joseph's family staring at me as I fumble through some sort of prayer attempt. Maybe not too Jesus-y. A light smatter in a jesus Hey, man, if you ever want to know how to, like, pretend to be religious around Jesus people, hit me up. HMU. 1-800. Call me now. Will he want to, me to pray? Is he going to pray at me? Do I have to pray at him? Fucking mouse, I swear to God! Mysterious person talking to Joseph, huh? I think that's... I'm talking to Joseph, Amanda. huh? Oh. God! How many times, how many times have I told you not to sneak up on me like that? I selectively ignore it every time you do, Popsicle. I'm gonna look through that, through that screen. Joseph can't read your mind, you know. If you want to talk, just message him. Fuck, you're good. Look how big her fucking eyebrow is. Yeah, that's like a fucking yeah. art. <laughs> but I've never been friends with a priest before. What do I talk about? My favorite Bible passages? Ice cream socials? Khakis? He's a pastor, not a priest. Is he a priest? Did I miss that? <laughs> <laughs> Shit! First of all, he's youth minister with a tattoo, not a priest. There's a difference. You're overthinking it, dude. Listen, just put it like this. <laughs> Hello, neighbor. Thanks again for the invite to the BBQ. I'd love to hang out, S-O-O-N, if you're not too busy. Isn't that a little too business casual? Fine, fine. Give me the keyboard. I got this. Amanda focuses in on the keys. Hi, Joseph. <laughs> it was great meeting you and your family. I'm still new around here, so if you'd like, I'd love to hang out and get to know you. See ya. Smiley face. The smiley is a nice touch. If you guys, this is one time, the one time like face cam would have been awesome. I don't know. <laughs> you just missed it, guys. A moment. Almost immediately, we receive a response. What would he say? <gasps> get into character. Get in character. Are you ready? What do you need? Do you need something? Do you need like? <gasps> you need lube. You need condom. <clears throat> Explain. Shut your mouth before I fuck it. <laughs> All right. Hi, pretty. If you're not doing anything in a bit, the kids and I are baking treats for the church bake sale today, and we'd love to have you over. It'll be a blast, so let me know. Huh, Joseph. Huh, Joseph. He uses a lot of exclamation points. Do people pay attention to that? What? The exclamation point usage? Because I use a shit ton. Oh, yeah, I do. Because, I like, like you, I read it as, like... Like, excitement. Yeah. Yeah, like I'd be like, "Hey Dylan, you ready to like record on Monday?" And then you'll be like, Sick. "You'll be like, definitely." And then I'll read it like as definitely, whereas if you did a period, you'd just be like, "Definitely." Yeah. Instead of yeah, yeah, I respond back. Sounds like fun, prick. E. Great, come by as soon. Come on by the spouse's house. House as soon as you're ready. We'll be there. Freudian slip. Well, guess I'm doing this. And I save a brownie for me. That's me. Promise you won't sneak up on me anymore. I promise nothing. 
I don't make promises I can't keep. Real to a fault, Popsicle. And Dad, please don't be weird about the religion thing. What's religion? <laughs> Me? Weird? Never. Next time on Pillow Talk! Yeah, we're gonna say hello to Joseph. Don't be weird, pretty. I gotta pee so bad. Go pee real quick and then we'll get back. We're gonna top this bit. <laughs> yeah, is that right? We're gonna top this bit. Let's do this. Ah! Ah! Alright, actually, do you want that to be the last episode? Fuck! And then we play something else. Fuck! You could always go on the last date with Damien. <laughs> I'm in love with him. <laughs> I was recording. Oh, really? <laughs> Shit. Stop recording. Oh my god. Oh my god. Now you're gonna make me fucking sit down. I'm gonna have to fucking go back, scroll on the screen, and then go boom. Oh wait, no, I was hitting...